welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Gemini Divination Oracle number three. Thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscribes. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Gemini Divination Oracle 333 back at you again. Thank y'all for y'all likes, y'all shares, y'all subscribes, and everything that y'all do for this channel. Don't forget, July 1st, for all the members and continuing every month, you're going to get a 15 to 20 minute reading. So, let me know what you think. Let's get into it. This is really smoking, y'all. I really do like the smaller cut um, Palo Santos because they burn fast. They don't burn fast, but like the, you know, they don't, they don't take a lot to burn. Like, them real thick, big ones, you know? But let's get into the message, y'all. Let's get straight into it. Um, let's get into the Sacred Creators Oracle. Let's see what's going on in your life before we get into the people that sometimes make it hard in your life because they see what you have going on. Let's see what's going on. Here, give me clear, clairvoyant, clear audience messages. I'm getting alchemy creator. So maybe someone, alchemy, something about alchemy. Maybe it's something that you're doing within the world to help others manifesting and doing. What else, spirit? Clear, clear, everyone, clear, audience messages. Raise. Maybe you, you're you trying to rise um, your vibration, especially in manifestation. Maybe um, things have been kind of slow. Maybe you feel someone throwing spell work at you or trying to manipulate to get things from you. I'm getting to the spark of hustle. So maybe someone is trying to, you know, get something going that is slow in their hustle. What else, spirit? I'm getting something. Maybe someone's birthday is on the 17th. Maybe someone born in 95. Maybe someone was born on the 9th or the 5th. Maybe someone was born in 75, 57. What else, Spirit? Clear, clear, born, clear, audience messages. I am getting raw intentions. So as long as you get raw intentions, it's all in your intentions and what you're manifesting, y'all. If you're doing it for the greater good of humanity and mankind, the manifesting is going to grow. But if you're doing it for the Oh, because I got all of this and because I got all of that. It's all of this and all of that helping humanity and mankind besides yourself. Um, moving forward. What else, Spirit? Maybe someone is 22 or someone's birthday is May 22nd. What else, Spirit? I am getting the sacred flow. So maybe being the sacred flow of manifestation is right here. Maybe somebody's birthday is on the 30th of May or you are 30. Always remember when you manifest, you have to have a, a, a clear, clean heart in mind. You can't do it for the, oh yeah, I want more money. I want more of this and I want more of that. And I want people to look at me as famous. Like honestly, when you're in spirituality, it's not necessarily about being famous or known it's just you getting the people from the darkness to the light it's not really all about oh my god i need all the subscribers don't get me wrong like those who are overachievers like me i want more people to go from the dark to the light through me to the divine because some people don't understand and know how to make it all make sense last card befriend the word polarized so maybe something about polarized. I need to look into that too for y'all. I'm trying to make things work as far as, you know, possibilities of things working how I need it to work. <sighs> Making that all make sense, y'all. Let's get into another message. That was for y'all because sometimes the message be like, oh, this is what's going on in your life. And this person is doing this, but I'm getting you're working on some type of creation. And you're trying to, you know, elevate it, you know, work on it, confirmation. Maybe somebody's working on, you know, customizing something. 
What else, spirit? Do I need to see for the collective of Gemini's? Give me another message. Is this the true emotional? How someone is truly feeling? It can be you or them. So, oh yeah, y'all, before I forget, take the messages as they resonate. I promise you, I had someone curse me out. I promise you, because the message wasn't what they wanted or the roles was reversed or they needed to be flipped. And when I looked at the situation, I was like, she must not know tarot or they're not immune or know what tarot is, especially if it's a general, if it's a general reading. This person decided that they was, you know, like they wanted this message to be theirs. But remember, we all know it's a general reading. If you need a personal reading, get at me. But she wanted trying to make it fit, y'all. I don't go with it. I don't like that one. That did not taste right. Y'all, maybe y'all have a bad taste in y'all mouth. Or maybe you went towards a person, place, or thing, and y'all went to go eat somewhere, and that taste, the food did not even taste good. Like, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't hitting. Okay, so y'all, let's get into the message. Spirit, what do I need to see? Mm -hmm. Secret, y'all. Somebody got a secret. The person that has a secret, y'all, is someone that you have a round and round cycle with, learning lessons and triggers from this person. Spirit, what else? This person again. Hmm. What did I just say? You and this person is always bumping heads. This person got a secret. That's why y'all bumping heads. Because they feel like this honesty is going to bring a total ending. I feel most definitely with the energy that I am getting, y'all. Whatever this cycle is, and whatever these triggers is, and whatever these lessons that you learn learning from this person or persons, learn from them because you're going to keep going through the same cycles over and over again. Someone's getting some type of bad news. Maybe this secret is bad news. They know if they tell you, there may be an ending between you and them. Hmm. What did I just say? They know that whatever this secret is, is bad news. And they know that you, when you find out, you're going to turn your back because y'all already bumping heads and you feel or have an intuition that something's going on, but then yet they're not being honest and giving you the opportunity to move how you need to move by knowing the truth. I'm getting something about maybe you're coping to try to deal with the situation. Hmm. And then I just tell you, you and this person bumping heads already. And when this secret comes out, you ain't going to hear nothing. And they're going to be straight rejected. This person thinks that you're an asshole because they feel that you shouldn't even have the, like y'all should love each other and that shit, even though they do make mistakes, but not learning from your mistakes, them learning from their mistakes, them constantly keep doing the same thing over and over again. Anybody in their right mind that's trying to make healthy choices would leave so that you can move out their way so that they can heal. This person is the type where when you turn your back, they try to sweet talk, try to come back because they want you to get back into this karmic cycle and you're not. Hmm. This person thinks that you're a jackass because they can't sweet talk you no more. They can't do that boom de boom notorious. That don't work no more. That's what they did. I'm getting pregnancy DNA. Or this was fake news. Um, I'm getting someone is getting bad news. Maybe someone lied about getting somebody pregnant. 
Maybe someone said this is fake news, this ain't true, woo, 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 but really it is. And they know that if you find out that they're the father of this child that they said that they were not, then they know that the relationship is going to be over. And or Gemini, you're in a situation where you probably didn't know that this person had somebody else. And this person kept telling the person that they would know I'm not the father, do do do. Then they come back, they are the father. And or it can go different ways, y'all. But that's crazy. People think that you're an, an ass because you are standing on business, standing on boundaries. You happily single. I'm getting um, you doing you, you know, you stress free. You know, you setting goals, career focus. Like, that's overall. These people thought they was going to have secrets and thought that they was going to be able to, you know, sweet talk you and, and have you submit. No, it ain't going to work like that. Not this time. What else, Spirit, for the collective of Geminis? What do I need to see? What do I need to see for the collective of Geminis? Clear, clear, point. Where audience messages for the collective of Gemini's. What do I need to see? Clear, clairvoyant, clear audience messages. Okay, it says, I love you. We are bonded in internal love that is beyond space and time. Close your eyes and reach into this expensive. Mm -hmm. Maybe someone that loves you was coming into your energy. What about this person? Or that's what this person truly wants to tell you? Someone's hopeful for a relationship with you all. I mean, with you. I'm getting... Um, Maybe you and this person went through some stormy situations. Even though y'all went through y'all situation, they still love you. They haven't been able to find anyone like you in your energy, whether it be friends, family members, lover. I'm getting silence. Your silence is a making like your your presence and your silence is is appreciated now, being that you're not there. They having to think. Mm -mm -mm. What else, spirit? I'm getting karmic battles. What did I say? This person loves you. They know that they have been going through karmic battles. They are trying to change their selves, you know, so that they can have a balanced relationship with you. But they're hopeful. Remember, they're hopeful, even though. There was things they did in the relationship that they should have been honest and communicated with you about. This person is insecure. This person is hopeful of a relationship with you, but they're abusive and they're insecure. They love you even though they were abusive towards you. Like domestic V. I'm getting soon. So someone feels that, I guess something about their silence is going to break soon or some or someone wants to come towards you soon. You don't even want to be around it because they're abusive. They're toxic. They're karmic. Who wants to be around somebody like that, y'all? Needing time apart. So you need, <clears throat> you need time apart from this person. Or do indefinitely because of them and how karmic they are and the battles that they go through that they want you to be a part of and we're not. Moving forward, what else, spirit? What else, spirit, do I need to see? I'm getting transparency. You can see through this person. You can see through this person. You can see how this person is you can see the real them you've seen them through their insecurities you've seen this person through their karmic moments and you just rather be on your own accord somebody misses you though 
they want to see you soon but i feel like people got to look at the energy is this person worth seeing you again do they did they deserve to be in your energy the first time message of love someone gonna bust out with a message of love but you see right through it you see through everything that they be doing but they're praying that you don't this person prays that you open up to them but i tell people this if you were in a committed relationship with someone and somebody decides that they want to step step out or they talk to you and then they ain't talk to you no more they ghosted and now they're starting to see how much they really liked your company and how much energy that you gave them or brought around them how you accentuated their happiness and they can't get that nowhere else <laughs> moving forward y'all first card i can't even spell it so let's see what's going on with this situation let me put that back in the deck let me see what needs to be said. Clear, clairvoyant, clear audience messages. What do I need to see for the Gemini's? Clear, clairvoyant, clear audience messages. Plan group effect, effort. So something about a plan group effort, y'all. I don't know if you see that, but something about a plan group effort. Somebody was in on a plan group effort. Y'all, it spit back out. <laughs> Spell work. That was a planned group effort. Someone had a group of people to help them do something because obviously they were weak. And they couldn't do it by themselves. Restart, reboot. So maybe somebody, something about somebody wanting to restart you back over or switch your lives or they did some type of spell work to delay whatever you had going on so that you can restart all the way over like in these video games like you have oh so many lives and once those are done you got to start all the way back from the end i mean the beginning you could be at the end of the game but them three lives and then you know of course you get these little you know things going through the games and stuff but i'm really getting that somebody wanted to really restart your life i'm getting new abundant beginning so this was in reverse somebody wanted to slow down your new begun, begun your your begun your beginning of your your abundance and they couldn't can't stand because it just seems like they weren't as far or getting as far as you and that's some bullshit y'all i can't what else spirit stress and anxiety somebody wanted to put this type of spell work on you or stress and anxiety maybe they feel like you're moving faster than them and they feel like and then you're here for a purpose they're here for a purpose but they're so focused on your purpose and you know maybe their purpose isn't your purpose or what you're doing or y'all being in the same quadrant of work maybe they're supposed to be doing something else but then yet it's like this person wants to slow you down slow trying to delay in in i don't know y'all these people are weird because one minute it just seems i don't know if this is a friend family member i don't know what this is but somebody will root you on but then on the other side it's like it can be like an auntie or something like that or it can even be a brother and like they will act like they support you but you don't really just see the actions like or they'll always tell you something on the flip side of something but then and yet when you look at what they have going on like the comparison is not there moving forward what else spirit clear clever one clear audience messages i'm getting right in your face okay didn't i okay somebody is right in your face trying to restart and reboot your life because they feel like once you restart then you know that you know they can catch up because you restarted and they are but i'm getting someone that wants to restart your life try to restart your life and then and yet you elevated even more than where you were before and they're upset and they're mad so they're like dang like when is my karma gonna come because i did this so that i can trip the chosen ones up i did this so i can flip and skip and trip this light worker up 
like I'm telling you, y'all, it's things that's coming. It's like, and you still kept persevering. Like, it can be the people that be dead in your face, that be playing in your energy. Really, It's like sometimes you can't even tell people. Like, you cannot tell people everything. It, I'm telling you, just tell your spirit team. Tell God. Because, honestly, they not been to um, sabotage something they're trying to help you get. When some people feel and they see, like, your gift and they see your elevation... You know, of course, people be like, oh, my God. It, but then it'd be those be like, oh, my gosh, man, I'm not even there yet, man. Slow them down so I can get there. Like, that's some BS, y'all. It's some trolls, y'all. Some big head, beady eyed hair on top of their head, just weird. And these trolls wanted, or these trolls had some type of group plan of spell work to reboot and restart your life. But, God, they wanted to give you stress and anxiety um, and I'm speaking the truth, y'all. I'm telling you, these people want to give you stress and anxiety because they know how you feel about your passions and what you're trying to do. They tried to trap you maybe a couple months ago, maybe even even now, even even <laughs> even now, y'all. These people are trying to trap you in some situation or a contract to where you can't get out of it. Make sure you read everything from top to bottom. Last card, 555. Maybe someone's been seeing 555, y'all. Change is coming, y'all. As much as these people try to get in the way and try to stop what you had going on, ain't nothing that they can do to stop you. Until the next one, y'all, peace, love, prosperity, and protection.